Good morning. Happy Monday, everyone. Morning. It's the middle of February already. And we're I there. We're there. <laughs> the sun's out today, though, so that's a good thing. That's right. It's Jason. And Carly. Carly with the gear group. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Happy back. to be back. Yeah. We, um, yeah, Riley filled in for us last week. She sure did. Yeah. Great job, Riley. <laughs> she jumped on just to talk to you a little bit about the 2018 new apparel items that we keep checking out and getting in stock because yeah. um, we're excited about them. So it is the season for the new lines, the 2018 lines. And you really, I mean, what she said was great. Make sure you guys swing on by, check that out because we got a lot of a nice stuff, not just in the corporate apparel, but. Well, yeah, just some fun stuff. I mean, I just ordered myself some of the new tank tops well, and uh, zip ups and and that kind of stuff too because they're comfy. I mean, by no means am I sponsored by New Era, but I'm telling you that new line they've got just take all my money. Right. Thank you. Yes. Yes, they do have some really, really nice, soft new <laughs> zip ups. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah that's a good. That. It's some good stuff. Uh huh. And so, hey, we've already got a couple of orders going out the door for. So, oh, my gosh, yeah, yeah for yep. sure. Well, that's, you know, helps. I mean, we kind of talk about them because not that we're sponsored by New Era, but, um, <laughs> um, but we really are a fan. So, yep. um, so yeah, and, and speaking of being a fan, um, I am definitely a fan. <laughs> of what we're talking about today. Of what we're talking about today. Wine drinkers unite. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Beer drinkers, wine drinkers. Weird, yeah, you yes. have it. All of this would be applicable in my home and as well as any business. <laughs> yeah. There we go. So um, one of the industries that we work a lot in is the food and beverage industry. And so um, today we've kind of compiled some samples for you thinking of you know, upcoming uh, wine and beer festivals that happen in the summertime and you yeah. get out there and start doing some tasting or, or that kind of thing. But, um, you know, bringing them together because they often kind of go, you know, you know, well, that's kind of like my husband and I. I'm the wine drinker, he's the beer drinker, you know. They, they <laughs> kind of go hand in hand, they work well. Depends on what day you catch me on, but yeah, I'm a little bit of everything. Well, and that's well, the same way, yeah, it's, it's very similar. Yeah. yeah, I mean, that's the nice thing about it too is, is that these are, I mean, kind of different uh, from your maybe what you're thinking everyday type of promotional products, but it's stuff that quite literally reaches out to large population, uh, large numbers. Yeah, and we've got you know items here that range in um, price and options. Of course, you know, yep. that's kind of what we do. And, and I think we're going to start with the uh, square. Uh, it's fancy. It's, this is a nice. wine stopper. Yep, this is the uh, square top metal wine stop. I mean, I know that uh, it's stainless steel. Yep, actually. it is. It is stainless steel. Uh, and this actually, it's really nice because this can be branded. So uh, one color, one location. Yeah, on you've got a, a one inch by one inch square on the top there, obviously, where the logo can go, and it includes that one color, one location. Um, and it doesn't look, I mean, when you say one inch, I mean, one inch doesn't sound like a lot, but this is a, I mean, this is an eye catch. When you put it on top of a wine bottle, wine bottle so everybody's <laughs> going to see it. <laughs> so that works good for a gift. Yeah. Um, it works good for a giveaway. Yep. Um, you're looking at about just over $4 for 100 pieces or so with a one color um, on there. Um, kind of a nice, you know, item to give away. Yeah, absolutely. And like I said, it's nice because if you're in that environment, if you have, uh, you know, you're in the food and beverage, in, or in the beverage industry, and you've got a celebration at the end of the year, or you're kicking off the new year, things of that nature. It's just a really nice type of home product that's not your kind of typical, uh, you know. Yeah, or even gift. giving these to restaurants and having them stack their wine bottles with your brand on top of mm -hmm. it. I mean, you could end up with your brand and you know, somebody else's wine, which isn't bad. And they that's see right. your brand. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> when the people are sitting at the bar looking across the, the, yeah. the wine. There. That's so, right. Um, and then if you're looking for more kind of a set and, and want to add to the wine stopper idea, um, we do have uh, many different sets, but this one that we have here comes with two pieces. So you're going to have the wine stopper here, and then in addition, you're going to have the corkscrew, yep. which I can see myself hurting myself. Yeah. <laughs> open that up there. It's got... Like um, I won't hurt myself. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just a little more expendable. <laughs> I think that's the truth. <laughs> <laughs> and even have a little knife there at the top. Yep. So All right. Let's so do it. You got, so you can actually uh, silk screen uh, print or laser engrave right on the corkscrew there. That's nice. And for 50 pieces for both of those in a set that come in a box together, you're looking at almost six bucks a piece. So. And these are. Yourself. And you can feel the quality in these. That's one of the things that I know we've talked about before is that. Uh, there's a lot of different types of products out there, but we want to make sure we show you guys nice things. 
about today. That's a good one. That's, this is a water. That's a Monday. Oh, oh, I was going to say, that's, really that's a good. Monday coffee. <laughs> um, but this, uh, you can feel the quality of these two. And then sometimes that's the concern as well when you go a little bit, when you're trying to travel outside the norm and you get something a little newer and things like that. But really, really good products, really nice material and quality here. So the next one happens to be my favorite. <laughs> yeah, so, this like, one is cool. This I, is cool. So, I have to agree. I think it's my favorite too. It is. It's a it's a nine ounce uh, stainless wine mug. So stemless. The stemless. Yep. The stemless. Stainless. Yep. Wine mug. And this one right here is a matte black, but it does come in a pearl white and also a brush stainless. Yep. It has a top. So we can take that off here and show you. A little accidental bump of the wine. Oh, it's going to be there okay. There we go. Minimize the spill. <laughs> so this is going to keep your wine cold. It's going to travel with you. Um, it's going to allow for a imprint or etching, etching. on the side. Yep. Etching is very sharp. Yes, yes, but I do. And these are nice because if you're out on a vacation, if you're camping, if you're, you know, these gifts are so nice because they can go anywhere. You want to take a walk. It's not, you know, and you like that. I mean, I don't know if you are, but I'm a huge fan of just taking a walk along the beach on a sunset. I got my stemless one. I'm sign me up. Well, so if I trip and fall, I don't spill. All. <laughs> well, and you know, when you're, if you're a white wine drinker, obviously it keeps the, it keeps the the wine cold. But even putting red wine in here is just going to help to let it travel with you. You know. Yeah, because um, obviously, in case somebody didn't know, white wine is chilled. You don't chill red wine, so. Well, some people do. No. I don't know why you would, but I've seen that. And then there's some people that put ice in their wine. I, yeah. That's, love you, babe. Um, but uh, so <laughs> she, she, so was, she does it, and every time she does it, she says, don't judge me. <laughs> I said, no, I'm not judging. That's so funny. I don't want to sleep on the couch. Yeah. I'm not judging. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, these, oh, so these are going to be at, this one specifically is about $12 for about 90 pieces or so. There are different options in these, and you can't even get like the shinier finish. This one's matte and tons of colors. I think I actually posted a picture on our Instagram not too yep. long ago of all the different colors of these. Um, but this one specifically is about twelve dollars for ninety pieces, a good quality one. Which nice is awesome. Hand wash. I mean, um, yeah, you're talking finish. about a branded gift like that. That's that lasts forever. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's a great gift. It's um, phenomenal. Yes, for sure. This is definitely our favorite. Right? That's definitely our favorite. So we can move on. <laughs> yeah, we'll go. These are cool. These are fun. Those are those make me think summer. They make me think events. They are fun. So these are plastic um, mugs. You know, uh, tasting mugs. So they yeah, are clear. One. They are five ounces. They come in different shapes. You can imprint uh, one color both sides, um, and those are perfect for. I mean, last time I used one of those, I think, was down at the Burning Foot Festival yeah, festivals. on the beach, you know, beer festival. These, um, and these are great if you are one of those vendors. If you're out there and you're a vendor at any type of event like that where you know there's going to be, you know, food, beverage, things of that nature, these are so neat. And well, and if you're the organizer of the event, mm -hmm. obviously um, that's a sponsorship you can sell Absolutely. for the event. So to throw, you know, one of the breweries logo on one of those and, and yep. give them a price for sponsorship then everybody's walking around the event with their logo on them and these are like super fun and easy to hold on to while yep. you're you know in between tastes and things they <laughs> but, are and, and, it, and it prints really well i mean i know that we're trying to show you on uh, on the facebook live here but they print the print jumps right off of there so it's very legible i mean and, and, and very recognizable mm -hmm. uh, so and these are great because you can get these like 144 of them for just over a dollar, so like around dollar twenty-five, uh, and yeah, they range, and, or you know, thousands of them, yep. you know, for a sponsorship to give one away with a ticket, you yeah, know, to you the event, right so on, for, around a buck, yeah, for that, yep. that's nice, yep. Well, yeah, those are really fun. Those are a good time. They're not the stemless <laughs> wine class, no, but they're pretty sweet. But they're um, I think last but not least, here we have back a, on the wine train. Yeah, back on the wine train. Um, we have a six-bottle wine tote. So this is going to be one of those, like, the non-woven polypropylene bags. It's going to be about 10 inches yes. by 11 inches by 7 inches wide. Um, but it's got actually it's, six individual yeah. pockets for the bottles in it and then a pocket on a each side pocket. of them. Yep. Um, 
And so it keeps the, bat the battles all together, but separate so they're not banging against each other. Um, you can have a, you know, one color, one location and print on these and get 100 or so of them for 275 250 somewhere in that range. And there's even a little, um, this is uh, the Velcro. This Velcro to hold the handles together. Yeah. Um, but if you're looking for ways to tra transport wine samples or you're going somewhere. Um, and you want to get noticed. You want to gear up and get yes, noticed. Yes, right. <laughs> you got to do it. Um, this one in particular comes in black or burgundy or um, royal. Yep, and these are, and they are really convenient. Uh, and the stitching on them is solid, holds up well. Uh, and I tell you, I'm impressed with the, uh, I mean, it's hard to see. I, I tried to show as good as yeah, I could, it like but different. it's black. Yeah. It's, but the, the it's, it's house good. if you want yep. to step in and see it. Just um, another reason to come visit us. Yeah. <laughs> um, but also, you know, I mean, I've even seen, they use these at Meyer, you know. Yep. Um, when you go and you get the, you know, four bottles of wine for them to come off, I might know about. Yeah, yeah, that sounds oddly specific. <laughs> yeah. But that's the nice thing too is is that if you, I mean, think you sincerely, these can be used in so many different environments. I mean, it's not just for if you're out and about with yourselves talking about the gifts and the type of situations. And that's one of the things it's that more we more for retail marketing, yeah, as well. So, and that's what we really like is is that if you have a project where there's any type of food, beverage, or anything of that, and because specifically that's what we talk about today. But I mean, obviously, anything we're happy to discuss. We love sitting down and having that conversation about what ideas could be. Oh, yeah. for sure. How we can help you to yeah. maximize your return on investment. Yeah. Um, we do actually in our showroom also have a um, kind of a restaurant food and beverage industry display where you yeah. can come in and look at some stuff. I mean, in addition to all of these products, we've got coasters, we've got aprons, we've yeah. got, um, I mean, different kinds of glasses, actually glass glasses and such. Um, yeah. We've got venues up there. We've got growlers up there. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I mean, tin techers, everything for your Coasters. breweries. Yeah, yeah. I mean, um, gosh, can I think of growlers? Bottle openers. We do this all, <laughs> we do all yeah, see, see who runs out first. <laughs> <laughs> but no, so no, sincerely, if uh, we would love to see you. Come on down. Thanks again, Riley, last week for showing some of our uh, 2018 uh, corporate apparel. Yeah. Uh, we're happy to be back. We're excited and ready to gear up and get noticed here for 2018 in the food and beverage industry. <laughs> Thanks for watching.